Hey everyone, today I have a video for you that just kind of happened. I didn't plan this or anything, but yesterday I just happened to go to a couple of drugstores to check out the sales and I ended up getting five lip balms. So I guess today's video is just going to be like a haul and first impressions type thing. So I'm just going to jump into these lip balms. So the first one is from Walgreens and it's basically like an EOS knockoff um, dupe maybe I've, I haven't tried it yet so I don't know they say it's new and I bought this specifically because I've heard Emily Noel 83 just rave about this and how good it is so I had to get it because she's like my favorite so that's why I bought this one here's what the packaging looks like let's see if this is really good I'm just gonna open it cuz I'm too excited so that's what it looks like and I can already smell I can smell it from here it's a really strong, oh my gosh, it smells amazing. It smells like Watermelon Jolly Rancher. And here's what the little ball looks like. It's not exactly like an EOS, but it's very similar. It feels really smooth on the lips. I really like the way it applies and it has a nice texture to it. It's not thick and it's not greasy. So we'll see how I like that one. So then I went to Rite Aid and I went to the lip balm section again because I'm a freak. And I saw this little EOS kind of dupey looking thing so and I haven't heard anybody talk about the Rite Aid version so I was like I bought the Walgreens one might as well get the Rite Aid one this one is strawberry sherbet flavored so here's what the packaging looks like on that and it says it has vitamin E and aloe for moist smooth lips it's basically the same thing so here's this Rite Aid one it has a little Rite Aid sticker on top this smells like mochi ice cream like strawberry mochi have you ever had that it's like oh my god it's so good this one smells so amazing this if you like strawberry you need to get this okay so here's what it's shaped like just like the Walgreens one um, and I'm gonna put it on so this one also feels very smooth and hydrating not too waxy just like the Walgreens one so they're probably the same manufacturer I'm guessing because I mean the packaging is the same on these except for the colors are different they both have like the wavy lines on the front and they both just have a little sticker. One says Rite Aid and one says Walgreens. So these aren't, you know, too different. So moving on to Lipsol lip balms. And you guys know that Lipsol, I've talked about it in a lot of my videos actually. Um, Lipsol lip balm, it absorbs into my lips, which is why I love it so much. It doesn't just sit on top of my lips and you know kind of disappear like most lip balms do the Lipsol one it's just unlike anything I've ever used I need to have a whole review on that because I could talk about that lip balm all day long that's why I bought these two so this one the new flavor is called vanilla plum it says it has intense protection with Swedish moisture lock locks in moisture for healthy lips SPF 15 um, natural shea butter and coconut oil so yeah, the packaging is like the same shape and size and everything. It's just um different color. So here's what this looks like. And all of Lipsol lip balms have a little B on the side. And I think that's like a nice detail. I, bees terrify me. But I think it's kind of a cute detail at the same time, even though I'm like terrified of bees. This smells like honeysuckles. Very sweet and natural though. It's not like, um, you know, like a cookie or something. It's like, it smells like a honeysuckle. It's really nice. It just tastes like honey, like natural honey it's not really overwhelmingly sweet like these are very sweet this says it's a vanilla plum flavor but when i smell it i smell honeysuckles and i taste honey i don't i don't really taste any vanilla or plum and um i don't remember if i found this at walgreens or rite aid or not i'll have everything listed down below with prices and where i got it because i went to so many places yesterday like i don't even remember and then i saw this one which said it was new so I bought it because I have a problem. So this Lipsol Lip Balm, um, intense protection, honey berry flavor, vitamin C and E, natural shea butter, helps protect and repair chapped lips, SPF 15. So there's what the packaging on that one looks like. I, I just love lip balm. I don't know why I do, well I know why. I just like putting on lip balm. I actually like get so much joy of putting on lip balm. I think it's because when I was little, I was obsessed with lip smackers, and I still have all of my old lip smackers. I know that's so weird, but I just, I'm like emotionally attached to them. So I have all of my old lip smackers in a bag still. Don't hate. It looks like the original one, except for the writing on it's orange instead of green. Um, Honeyberry. 
It smells like potpourri that you put in your house. It smells like some sort of like Febreze. I just don't know which one. Maybe like the linen one. <laughs> and the last lip balm that I had to get, this was just an impulse buy, um, Chapstick Mixstick. I bought the green apple and caramel one because I love green apples. Um, they're my favorite apple. I don't know why it was so hard for me to think of saying that. So here's what the packaging on this looks like. It's nice and colorful. It's pretty fun. It says mix together and create a fun flavor. Amazing dual sided lip balm that can be used to create new flavor combinations. So here's the size of it. Um, I think it's kind of cool looking. So let's do this. I'll do one lip caramel and I'll do one lip green apple. Is that weird? Going to go in with the green apple. Oh, that really smells like green apple. This smells like green apple Jolly Rancher. It's really strong. It's a lot stronger than the caramel side. I'm gonna mix them together. It just smells like green apple. <laughs> but I think the idea is really fun and cool. So, cool idea with this chapstick. I like it. So, those are all the lip balms that I bought. I don't know why I bought them all at once. Um, I'm not normal. I don't know what came over me, but... It happened and I decided to make a video about it <laughs> so I will be testing all of these out and I'm gonna see how I like them and I don't know if I'll do individual video reviews for each one so I hope you guys enjoyed this kind of random video um, totally wasn't planned and I just made it because I thought it'd be fun and a couple of you guys on Twitter were like yeah you should do a video so I did it if you guys know of any really good lip balms, like let me know your favorites or if you want me to try a new lip balm that's out, just tell me in the comments and as always, thank you guys so much for watching.